Golden Empress collection here. And I just had to come and share this message with you guys. I, I just see them as they start to come out. I decided I'm going to give you guys little minis when I see them. This is what it is. Hero font, the tower and the sun card. You are dealing either with a Taurus, a Scorpio, a Leo. You could also be dealing with an air, excuse me. I was going to say Aries. So let's just let that fly. Um, or an Aquarius. There's also a Sagittarius here. You know, a lot of those energies, if those are highly aspected in your chart, this might just be a whole reading all about you. But whatever just happened in your relationship, whatever, and I'm hearing a sugar honey iced tea storm just happened in your relationship, it has been revealed that it was done on purpose, okay? It was done by the divine to create some sort of, you know, bombshell around all of the toxicity and everything it is that you were going through. You had a relationship that was just straining you and stressing you. All right. The way that you two were communicating with each other was horrible. There was a lot of obsessive behavior. There was a lot of difficulty. It was just, you know, who can take control, tit for tat, taking someone's swords and then someone going in and taking this. It was just way too much. You know, I'm not sure what it is that happened between the two of you but spirit broke y'all up on purpose all right i'm not even gonna lie look at this you got that sun card and you got that temperance card okay if you got two different people here then someone knows that they're about to be going through it because of some sort of toxicity or some sort of drama right and then i mean you could have a sagittarius here that um is lying about being some sort of I don't, I see the back and the forth here. I don't know what this back and forth is, but I know that there's quite a few people involved, right? Sagittarius might be the ringleader and whatever this is. It's a lot of different drama. I'm telling you, okay? Somebody could be trying to go back and forth and creating some sort of nightmare. Whatever this is, it's a nightmare of lack. All right? Whew. Somebody is, it's almost like strategy. I'm picking up on strategy with this. Revealing of someone's strategy. An Aquarius vibration. Or someone is going through a tower moment because they see something unexpectedly. They hear something unexpectedly, right? Or there's a conversation about who's in control. Or there's some sort of love affair. Or someone is... Is, is finding out that there's a lie. There's been a lot of nasty, disgusting gossip here. And I don't want to do gossip. I really don't. I would rather stay in this vibration of where spirit says, you might want to leave these people alone. Okay? Because this is not okay. There is definitely a Scorpio here that's not taking responsibility either for whatever it is that needs to be spoken out loud like they are having a hard time dealing with whatever that is there's also something here where somebody wants to come in and try to control whatever it is that you're doing and they're lying in order to do this i they maybe they try to control you because they think you're lying but there's a lot of control here and they are on their way in no ifs ands or buts about that yeah you do have two fives here with this knight of wands so this is actually someone who could you know, want to be physical or pretends to be physical in some way. It's kind of a peacocking energy, but it's not just a peacocking energy. It's a, it's a, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe there's people that are jealous, like, and say, you know, it could be a jealous energy. And somebody needs to apologize for the way that they approach this particular person because this is a chosen one right here, baby. And this is someone who is not going to, I hopefully will leave the foolishness out in the cold here. Maybe this is someone who just needs to know, yeah, you might be at work. You might be in this particular place. You might have these people trying to come for you, telling you how to live your life, how to do something. And you're not feeling it. I promise you, you're not. You need someone. Someone here is a trendsetter. You are a lawmaker, a rule breaker, something, however this works for you. But you are not going to let the norm dictate how your life is, works, whatever. 444 four, four on the clock as I say that. I'm sure it'll be edited somehow, but whatever. It was 444 four, four when I said that. Spirits wants you to experience something new here. And if you choose not to, if you choose not to be this rising phoenix is what I'm hearing, 
then yeah, you will run into some sort of conflict here. No, I'm here and just if you know that this is as simple as you're dealing with a player, let them go. Something about Wheaties. Maybe this person, Mikey, somebody Mikey likes it. Is I don't know. Maybe this person says that to you all the time. It might be a joke. That's random for somebody, I guess. Yeah, this might be some. And you so you feel like you have a history with this person. I know you do. Yeah, look. You do. You know why? Because there's a pair here. And there's a whole relationship and it hurts. Whatever this is, yes, it does hurt. But you know what? You'll feel better once you tell the truth to yourself, okay? There's also someone else here that's got something to say. There could be a relationship with a whole nother person. Yeah, see what I mean? Somebody could finally come and just admit that they're married, okay? And whew, if you guys are dealing with somebody like this, Three of Pentacles was there. Three of Swords is there. The Seven of Swords is there. There's betrayal behind whoever it is that you're dealing with. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. You definitely have a Taurus here. If the Taurus is the one lying, the Taurus is the one lying. That's all I'm going to say, okay? And this Taurus expects commitment in marriage, right? But I think if this, and this, is, if this is a Taurus female, that masculine is like, nah, I have a new friend. And my new friend is telling me you want some BS. Yeah, the new friend is right. Somebody's going to chuck somebody the deuces here, especially if it has to do with money. They're not giving anybody a penny. Yeah, I'm just here. I'm picking up like a shark vibe of someone like it's like a black widow type of energy. Someone is coming for somebody and that is so toxic. My opinion, some people might want to do that. That's just how they live their life. But no, there's going to be an Aquarius here that's going to run up against a whole lot of problems here in a little bit. And is trying to, to pursue someone for their money. Um, spirit baby, let me tell you, okay, the system is going to shut down those that have done wrong. That's all I can say. So we're going to let this go right around 7-11 or so because you guys are blessed. You're lucky. Those lucky numbers are going to be coming in for you is what I just heard. Yeah, you are to where, you know what? I hope somebody does attack you because you know what? If they do attack you, baby. You're going to have so much freaking money that they wish they hadn't attacked you. Understand what I mean? Because they won't get anything. And then turn around. You'll have everything you need and then some. And you actually would have shared with them had they not done you dirty. Mm -mm. That's that spitefulness right here. That tit for tat. I'm getting out of here. I'll see you guys later. Friday Night Love Tarot is your weekly. <laughs> Peace and elbow grease.